Hey guys, so today I wanted to do like a natural, everyday kind of no makeup kind of look. So I'm starting off uh, with clean hands and a clean face. I'm just gonna moisturize my face using the Cetaphil Daily Moisturizer. And now I'm gonna be mixing two different foundations together. All the products will be listed down below. So I'm just using a palette here. Um, and I'm gonna blow on the foundations to make them like flat, as you can see, like to just get a little bit of product on the end of the brush. And I'm using a buffing brush here, so I'm just gonna buff that in all over. So I'm gonna take it down my neck and behind my ears. Because my hair is so blonde, it kind of looks like orangey whenever it gets on the baby hairs, like around my forehead. So I just usually like wipe that off afterwards. I'm just gonna fill in my eyebrows here really quickly with a Smashbox pencil in something taupe. And now I'm just gonna blend the color out and upwards with a little eyebrow brush, just to make it look a little bit more natural. And carve out the bottoms here with a Q-tip. Now going with a little bit of Select Moisture Cover from MAC, it's concealer in NW25. I'm just gonna barely even touch that on the end of a blemish that I have. Just super, super lightly buff it on top, like barely even touching the skin and just keep doing that and then it'll just disappear. And whatever's left over on the brush here, I'm just gonna put it underneath my eyes to cover any dark circles. I'm just gonna blend it in with my finger and a beauty blender and use that uh, same foundation brush just to buff out the edges. Now I'm gonna set everything here with Mineral Veil by Bare Minerals. It's gonna be patting that onto the skin, try not to move the foundation a whole lot. This is using um, a little one of three Kabuki brushes I got in a trio off Hope Look. I'll post the link down below. Sometimes they have brushes on there, like 70% off. So now using this bronzer, it's NYC Bronzer and Sunny. I'm just gonna take that all along the outside of my face. Like in a three there, so the forehead, the cheekbone, under the jaw. It's an easy way to remember like where the bronzer goes, just in a three. Now taking that same bronzer and just any kind of a fluffy eyeshadow brush, this is just like a flat shader brush, I'm gonna work that into my crease and into my outer V and just blend it up. Just gonna give a little bit more dimension to my eye. And it's just easier than using an eyeshadow because I've already got it out. Now I'm just gonna contour my nose a little bit with it since I already had it out. This is using Apricot Kiss. It's a L'Oreal True Match Blush. I'm just gonna pop that all over my cheeks and buff it out here to get a little bit more of a natural finish with that Kabuki brush. Now I'm taking a highlighter here. This is actually a bronzer from e.l.f., but that one light shade is a really nice highlighter on a small stippling brush. I'm just gonna run that on top of my cheekbones. And I'm gonna finish off the look here with some mascara. I'm using quite a lot of mascara because I'm not using any eyeliner. So I'm starting off with the CoverGirl Clump Crusher, now going in with Great Lash by Maybelline and finishing off with the L'Oreal Voluminous. And I'm just gonna pop on some lip balm and be done with it. Thanks for watching, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please hit the like button to give it a thumbs up. And don't forget to check me out on Facebook. It's facebook.com slash beautybangle and on Instagram at beautybangle. Um, both links will be in the down bar along with all the products I used today. And if you could please subscribe, that would mean so much. Thanks, guys.